What's going on guys? This is Jack. Welcome to the channel. And today I'm going to be looking at another bunker that is in Scum. And we're going to talk about uh, if you should come here, uh, how to get in, how to get out, and talk about the loot that is in there. So as you notice, I'm here in C1, right about in the middle. There's my, using my mouse, there you go. You can see it right there at the end of this long road. Uh, but guys, yeah, this this bunker is a little different from the other ones, and we'll get into that in the future. But guys, if you enjoy the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Let's get started. Okay, guys, so as I said, we are in C1, right there, in, pretty much in the middle. Now, this is another bunker, and unlike the other the first bunker we showed this one actually I would characterize it as a small bunker now I just got here and there are two to three uh, zombie puppets walking around um, I killed a couple so I would if I were you I would expect anywhere from four to six just kind of on the outside down there by that road leading up to uh this kind of up to this right this uh left side which is the west side now i chose to come over this way because the entrance is pretty much right in there it's a little hard to see from the outside let me see if i can get a better angle on it for you ah there we go it's right there that concrete in there and uh, it's actually this is actually a really easy one to get into the only problem with this one is that it's a uh, it doesn't have as good of loot as the other bunkers that I've been to so uh, I'll now let's go ahead and I'll just show you how to get in and um and yeah we'll just we'll show you that and then i'll we'll kind of talk about some of the loot as well and talk about the layout of this bunker let's get started okay so guys i was um uh, about to head in and i heard some gunshots so i'm trying to be a little bit quiet and i'm gonna try to get closer i think somebody is inside or on their way out but I want to try to catch them by surprise uh, normally I wouldn't put this yep there you go more shots so I think they're getting out and they're maybe looting some of the buildings that are around the outside which by the way for this for this uh, bunker it's really not worth it the ones on the outside don't really have much and they're easy to do. I'm not sure what this person is, why they're getting shot at. I'm going to get up here because the uh, hole in the fence that you use to get through is right right there. Yep. That's not at me. That's definitely not at me. So this person's getting shot at. Um, so, a couple things about this bunker, guys, while we wait for this guy to come out. Uh, there are two mech walkers in here. One in front and one in back. And the one in back, you can kind of see it every once in a while on my left. He, he's not even a factor like at all. You don't have to worry about that one at all. It's basically just the lower one. The one that you can see right on my screen now. Uh, the one, that one can see you as you're getting in this hole in the fence. And it will be the one that kind of guards you from getting in the front door so you you really kind of just need to watch out for that guy okay wonder if I can see him over here yep definitely not at me so he's getting shot at by that left mech Let's see if we can get an angle here he's probably searching those other buildings here let's see 
Yeah, he's got to be over here, I'm guessing. Unless I see him stop, I'm not going to shoot at him. I want to get a close shot with the shotgun. Okay, guys, I think he's coming. He's got to be getting close. Oh, I got his... Got a zombie up here. Hmm. I wonder if I should shoot this zombie. It'll kind of give away my position. I think I'll wait. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's teleporting. Get him. Get him. Yes. Back to back. See ya, buddy. Guys. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Beautiful. Guys, the uh, the combat in this, the P PvP, is a little messy, as you can tell. But the shotgun is so good from close range. Let's see if I can search this guy. Perfect. From behind this tree. We got him. I'm going to get whatever he's got. I don't think he has much because uh, I was just in there. So, yeah. A few bullets. Okay, guys. Now I'm going to show you how to get in. So see, you can get to this tree, no problem. And these things are actually already on alerted. They're in alerted mode, or I don't know what you'd call it, but basically they're red. So just get in here, and he's running, or he's going the other way. So I'm just going to charge in here to this little trailer. And this is how I do it, guys. Kind of crawl up here, kind of use this bush and these sandbags, and just wait till he turns his back, because he's gonna walk over this way. He's he's pretty close actually right now. As soon as he turns his back and starts walking the other way, we can just sneak down, no problem. Oh, he's right there. See that bush helped a lot. Okay, he turned his back. No problem. Shouldn't have any problem. I'm just gonna go. All right, he's probably gonna turn. Oh, he's turning around. Okay, let's go. All right, there's kind of a delay sometimes when you're trying to sprint, so that took a second. Anyway, you're home free here. And so you can see that guy kind of grabbed a bunch of stuff. Um, so some things about this bunker. Honestly, it's really only good for one to two people. It's very small. It's not the same as the other one. Um, there's not as good of loot here. When I came in by myself, the only things I really took out was ammo. Um, granted, I already had guns, but I believe I found one AK. Which actually was by the door on the ground. I'm not sure if that was a natural spawn or what. Um, I found ammo. A couple food items. Not even a lot of ammo. Just a couple. Uh, just a, a few bullets of each kind that I wanted. Um, I found an AK. And I found a hunter rifle. Um, I don't think I even found a scope or anything like that. So honestly, this is not one I would go out of my way for. If I was in the area, I would, I would probably stop in if I had just started a character. All right. So basically to get out, it's pretty easy. We're just going to wait for this guy to turn and there we go. And he gets far enough away. You can see there's the AK on the ground. You can pretty much just kind of trot out, no problem, and just follow your way back out. You get back to the, the back side of this trailer up here, and you are home free. So then you probably just want to just watch to make sure he doesn't see you as you run out. I'm looking for the other guy, because he could see me, but I doubt it. Okay. So he'll walk towards me a few steps and then turn around and head to the left. Once he turns, yep, we're good now. Cool. 
So that's it guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If it was helpful, be sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. If these videos are helpful, help you go over some of the loot and uh, ways in and out of these bunkers, be sure to leave a comment and let me know. Uh, and I can keep making them. There is a bunch of these uh, bunkers throughout the game. So throughout the map. Uh, so as I said, once again, this is C1. And not recommended. I would definitely go to C2. So far, C2 is the best one. But anyway, guys, as I said, thank you so much for watching. And we will catch you next time. Bye-bye. Oh, <laughs>